to a Spider-Man uh, review once again on the video games. Two more left. Um, let's just say I really, really enjoy making these videos for you guys, and uh, I hope you guys, if you guys did enjoy this, leave a like. Um, and if you subscribe, say I subscribe in the comment section below, and I will comment back. So, um, the first game that we are starting off with, with is The Amazing Spider-Man. Spider-Man, he has a lot of... In this game, he he's the Andrew Garfield version of Spider-Man. He sounds like he's the actor of Donatello. Yeah, it's weird. Um, I really don't think it fit, but it was pretty good. The game, you can s swing as high as you want without carrying and without uh, having to have buildings around. You can do so much cool things. Story, and you can explore the hub world. It is amazing. You can fight the lizard. You can you can fight. You can go back to old levels that you really enjoyed. And you you can talk to like Gwen, and you can talk to Doctor Connors. And the storyline is really great. So if you guys did enjoy. Enjoy. If you guys did enjoy that game, tell me um, because I really enjoyed it. When I first played it, I was like, "Okay, this is kind of like a movie game." When I got, and I'm like, "Okay, I'll play it." And then I realized, I'm like, "Wait, this is after the movie, so this continues the story." And it was cool. And I really enjoyed it because you actually got to talk about, like, the new cool villains. And, like, you got to talk about the lizard, this crazy robot obsession guy. He loves robots. I love robots. Yeah. <clears throat> and and he's, uh, he's like, I love robots. I love them. I love robots. Robots, I love him. And that's how he is. He's like, I'm walking on robots. Hey, I'm walking on robots. Hey. And, um, yeah. Also, he does, like, Spider-Man stuff. Spider-Man gets all up in his business and tries to figure out how to beat his robots and how to beat him and then you get a gameplay where Spider-Man stops fight has no powers because the crazy robot guy stole Spider-Man's powers and you get a little bit of gameplay with it out anything no web shooters because he took away those but then you get those web shooters and all you have you can't swing because you're so weak you can only shoot out the web webbing balls and the the web balls and the um and uh, the web line to pull something barely it takes you a it took me a while to get used to the controls when spraying was like that. And uh, then um, also you can have different costumes. You can have like a weird mixture of a different um, Spider-Man uh, with a regular Spider-Man that you play in the game mixed with like this cross species thing and it looks creepy. You can play like black man suits, and there's really cool things. <clears throat> and um, and uh, well, there's also a little bit of um, cool webbing with um, cool tricks, and there's like a lot of fighting in this game, and uh, 
Well, I think that's pretty much it about the game. Moving on to the Amazing Spider-Man 2 video game. So, this one, it has better graphics, and uh, I have more suits, like more Spider-Man suits, uh, it's, and, uh, and then you get to look in the house, you get to look at um, Peter's Aunt May's house, and um, it was really cool. Um, you got to play as the old suit from the old from the first game and the original suit from the movie where he's like has just that mask and a little black hood over his head and uh I believe that's it um for and but you get to like ask questions and figure out more deeper into like comic book stories and like Harry Osborn and Black Widow and and like a bunch of the characters and it was really fun. Um, what's another game that it's kind of like um you get to try finding as much information um and also sometimes I see people can't find that information things and then they don't know that information like some other ones do and have more information on what they did and how this happened and uh and then you like and uh, a little bit you team up with craven and uh and there's like the last battle is with Carnage, and that battle took me a while to beat. Actually, it wasn't that hard, but it was very enjoyable. And uh, yeah, pretty much that's it. Um, and uh, I hope you guys enjoy the game uh, review of Spider Man. Might make a part. Might make another part, but I'm not so sure. Once I play the new one that is coming out that I saw the trailer of, I will um, uh, possibly do a review on like other games and stuff like that. And uh, hope you guys enjoy. If you did, hit that like button, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye.